Hi, it's Lori again. I've got another shopping video. Um, this one is going to be a little bit of Amazon and a little bit of um, Rye Lane Home, one of my catalogs. So let me get that open because I think I know what's in here. Don't we always think we know what's in there? But I did order some bedding. They had some bedding on clearance. I like to use them for the couch and have extra ones because the messy, messy creatures over here, sometimes things don't agree with them. And I have to get up in the middle of the night, change a, change a blanket or something. So yeah, that's what's in here. So these are, these are pretty. Because the one I have on, oh God, did I buy another one of the same thing? <laughs> I might have bought another one of the same thing that I have on here. I'll have to take a look. Because I like to buy the, um, this, this futon is full size. But I think I've been buying twin size because they wash up easier in the washing machines. It's uh, easier for me to wash them. So this could be just the two blankets, which would be fine. So this one is, yeah, this is not the same. It's kind of the same colors, but it, Is for day bed. Okay, that's perfect. I don't know if it comes with a, um, I don't want to open it, but I don't know if it comes with a pillowcase sham. It might. So this one is kind of a, a brownish and they're, they're quilted looking and I like this size because it, it goes in the washing machine. So yeah, it's, it's got the brown flowers and the, um, the green leaves. And this one, is the same thing in yellow it has yellow flowers and the green leaves so and these are all clearanced out it's a day bed size so that'll be perfect i can probably use it on the futon here so that's all that was in there i should have some more coming from them now i have an amazon package and i think i know what's in here too <laughs> I'm going to stop guessing, though, because I'm always wrong. Um, good thing I didn't guess, because I'm not sure what this is. Oh, it's just in a... Okay. It's just in a box. It was... I, okay. All right. Oh, that, to be careful with these scissors. I watched one of my videos the other day when I was editing it, and I've got a knife in my hand, and I'm waving it around, and I'm like, oh my God, they're probably screaming at me to be careful. <laughs> Put that knife down. <laughs> I know, I know on the worst cooks in America, they're always running in the kitchen with knives and stuff, and I thought, oh my God. Yeah, maybe I'm the worst cook. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. I, I've only really hurt myself once at work. Well, I've stabbed myself a couple times, but nothing major. The big one I did, I was, I was at work. I was, I had a, a switch blade thing that you're supposed to close up. And after I opened up the plastic, I was taking it off instead of closing it. I left it open and I sliced my thumb and immediately I put pressure on it and just wrapped it up with a bunch of tape and a, a napkin and just left it there and for like another hour until I went to break. It was almost time to go home and I had a, a friend go in the bathroom with me. It was a, a single seater, so oh, single bathroom so I could have, it was a guy I had him go in with me so he could look at it <laughs> and tell me if it was okay. And the knife was sharp, clean cut. You you can't even tell where it was. It was on one of my thumbs. But, oh my God, that scared me. Because I wasn't supposed to have the knife. If you get hurt with something that is not regulation, you can't kill anybody. <laughs> because you'll get in trouble. You weren't supposed to have it if it wasn't regulation. So I couldn't, I couldn't really tell anybody I got hurt. So I just had a bandage, a bandage on it and was hiding it. So. Okay. I got 
a 10 pack variety set of popcorn from Amish country. When you go online and you do a search for popcorn kernels, oh my gosh, this one comes up almost immediately. And there are 10 four ounce bags, all different. Every one of them is different. So I was planning on doing a popcorn test testing because they're all different. There's some baby white, baby white. There's red popcorn, um, extra large, purple, and uh, it's backwards. I can't see it. Um, you can probably read it. Mushroom. Is that say mushroom? It says mushroom. Okay. And then on the other side, there's five different ones. There's a medi medium yellow. There's a rainbow. There's a ladyfinger. Ladyfinger. A blue and a medium white. So my plan is to have a tasting. I'm going to pop up all these popcorns and look at them. And I'm going to have a giveaway. So that's going to be coming up. I'm going to give away some popcorn. And uh, that'll be different. But I love popcorn, so I get to eat it. So that's what was in that bag. Now, this other one might have something to do with this because I did buy something else. Oh, what do you want? Where do you want to go? You want to sit over here? Come on. Don't sit on the scissors. Okay. All right, let me look at this one. I think this is the other thing. Now those are little four ounce containers and I have a whirly pop, but I didn't really want to get out the whirly pop because you got to use grease and, and everything. And, and you know, I, on, on TV, I, on TV and YouTube, I see people just put a pot on the stove and they put popcorn in it and it makes popcorn. I'm like, that's too easy, right? Yeah. So I got something to help me make popcorn. That better be what's in here. Cause I just said that it is. Okay, cool. I'm right. This is what I'm going to use. Oh, wow. They take that good. Okay. This is what I'm going to use to make the popcorn. It's going to be in the microwave. And there, I was debating on getting a couple different things. I saw somebody online, Barry White. I love him. And he was testing a silicone one. It was just real small and it had flaps on the top that you fold over and he couldn't get them to stay closed. So I thought, well, then that's a good thing. I saw that because I don't want that. And then they had other ones that have lids on them and they're collapsible and you just, you know, silicone and you just put that in there. I'm like, okay, well, I was looking, looking. Well, I decided to get this one. It is like a little popcorn tea kettle. It's so cute. Look at this. See? It's like a little popcorn tea kettle. And I'm pretty sure the four ounce bags that I have will fit in here just perfect. This is one and a half quart. I do not want a lot. Um, I'll have to read the instructions, but... Um, oh, you fill the lid with popcorn so you know how much to put in and then you can put butter in here so um and it'll melt over your popcorn but i got some of that that oil stuff that they have that's called movie theater and i need to put it in a spray thing because i'm gonna i just want to spritz it with a little flavor i don't want to soak it so um because i'm going to be tasting a lot of popcorn but isn't this cute and that just goes in the microwave and you just make a little bit. That's nice. And I'll have to see those, those little bags are four ounces. So I'm going to get another one of those and, um, I'm going to, I'm going to give some away in a giveaway when I do my popcorn video. So that will be coming up the pike probably next month. So is that all in this video?
yep that's it that's all i got this time so um thanks for watching look forward to some popcorn and i still have videos open for giveaways there's going to be a link at the end to the playlist one through six they close on the 26th and i'm drawing the winners on the 27th so hit the little bell thingy so you'll be notified when it goes up and you won't miss the the winner video and um i'm gonna make it short so it won't be you won't have to sit through a big old big old to do so thanks for watching and bye